What's good? It's your boy Wade Walker, aka Young 2D God, aka USA 2D God, aka Wavy Surfer, aka Cami Killer, aka. Anyways, um, I got something here. We're gonna do parries to certain characters. So I took three characters. We're gonna do Ibuki, Karen, Cami. Things that you should look for to parry, as well as like the parry timings for when they do wake up reversal. I feel like that is something I'm gonna add to my game when people do wake up reversals or when I predict they're gonna do it. I'm just gonna parry, get the meter, as well as uh, make them look like a jackass in the process. So, let's start. You only need to do two hits. That's safer in people's opinion, but personally, to be the most optimal. There you go. What is that? Let's see how much bar that is. That's what it took uh, six parries, so that's what a third of a bar. So you get a third of one V meter if you, if you parry that on her way. So that's one thing. Definitely needs to look for. It's high variance, but it's worth it in my opinion. I think this is her overhead. Yeah, you can react to it. Again, that's just all meter. I'll get the point. I don't. You can't get solar point. That. So I guess your best option would be go for Oki, as well as. Oh shit. Go for Oki. Um, let's see, what's the second option we got? I think this is our Kunai. Again. You can react to the Kunai. I'm pressing it as soon as I see the kunai come out. But, um, again, should be parrying that free B meter. I trigger faster. What is this? I'm not sure what this is. Let me see. Our bomb. One, two, three. You just gotta wait three seconds on activation to mix up. One, two, three. Back in the block. One, two, three. You gotta count three seconds as soon as the boss is around. One, two, three. Oh shit. One, two, three. Alright, I'm gonna get it this time. One, two, three. There it is. Kinda risky, but again, if you parry, if you know you successfully parry that. Her next input, you can either parry, DP, it's up to you. Don't take shit on block. I believe this is her. I don't know why people would do this, but it's two hits. Oh. And of course, last, you need to be able to parry her super.
I'm pressing the parry after the animation. After this. That's when I press parry. Right after that. You get a solar flex combo, of course. You have to know how to parry that so you're not put in no chip situations. As far as I know, Ryu is the only character that could parry himself out of chip situations, so... With that in mind, the most important things against Ibuki is to parry her overhead, because it's only minus two, so you won't be able to get a punish unless you, you parry it. Also, parry her critical art, and it's high risk because, I mean, it's a guess, but parry her wake-up DP. You have to parry the wake-up DP. It's going to do more mental damage than it actually is going to do damage on the screen. Because, I mean, if you parry someone's wake-up reversal, not only did you know that you're, they're going to reversal, but you, you put your balls on the line and showed them that, yo, I'm going to get this extra meter in the process. Here's another character. Uh, yeah, I lost some points in a rank match, but it's all good. I'll get them back. I'm probably gonna play a little bit later today. You have to see that that's not the charged V skill, the charged V skill. Why am I getting it? You cannot get solar plex on none of these. There's that. Um, pretty simple. What's number two? This move. If you're crossing, you only gotta carry one hit, which might be easier for a bunch of people. Not easier for me. I just parried the two hits. Why am I not getting it? One, two. One, two. Again, go for two hits if you can parry it. Because look, you get one third of a bar. The faster you are at getting these parry timings down, or even understanding the situation, like no one's just gonna blatantly throw that out. But if you show the fireball game to her, they're either gonna jump or use that move to get around it. Unless they have meter, they're gonna burn meter for shoulder. But you can parry your shoulder as well. So. Keep that in mind. Uh, what's the third? I think the third is actually shorter. The timing on this one's a little weird. Okay, I didn't get it. Why am I not getting it? I must be pressing it till the free animation. There you go. Crush counter. Not crush counter, but V trigger cancel combo. Do whatever you want. Pretty simple. It's a little slower than what you think. Uh, what's number four? A 
that's, that's, what is that? Medium shoulder? Light shoulder, excuse me. Alright, and same thing with her on her wake up. See that shit? Yeah, you can wait, but you could also just parry it. Get that little meter. I think that's it, pretty much, as far as pairing her and then pairing Cammy next. I'm gonna do every I'm just gonna. Pick some basic things that are overlooked. That no one's really like taking into account. Because these will definitely get you further in the game. As far as like I guess versatility with Ryu. Let's just do this right quick. Only one hit. Actually, I don't know what you think about it. Let's just do the meter right quick. Alright, that's how much meter you get. With just a regular standard bait. Again, slightly more. I think that's worth it. Uh. Standard one everyone should know. Not too much of that. Three hits. Looks like you only get crouched. I mean, look how much meaning you get from that, actually. And you rip away her, uh... The, the plus she was going to be here. Trying to get back heavy kick. Just go for Crash Spears. That's probably the best. Go for Crash Spears, Tatsu for the Oki. Actually, no, I figured it out. If she's gonna land, if she's not at the crown of your like head, if it's jump, then just go for regular. 
probably the max damage you can get without V Trigger. But if she's at the top of your head like this, just press forward heavy kick, and it'll try to change the inference to the back heavy kick. It says counter. So there it is. If she's in front of you, as far as like her arc jump is right in the front, just regular back heavy. But if she's at the, she's a buck. Don't press forward heavy kick. What? Damn it. With the you can do crouch fears, stand heavy push, crouch fears, stand roundhouse, crouch fears. I'm talking about like crouch fears, V trigger, stand heavy punch, cross fears, V trigger, stand roundhouse. It sucks you can't get solar plex, but yeah, it's whatever. Uh, let's see, there's there's not much with Cammy. As soon as animation's over, that's when I would press it. Press the parry. That's it so far. Um, if there's anything I missed as far as uh. In within Karen, Nabuki, Kami, you know, leave a comment below. But I think for the most part, those are just like the basic things that get overlooked. I know I block them a lot, especially Ibuki's overhead. Now that I see how easy it is to just parry it, it opens up way more options as far as your offense when to take the approach. So now you can use the parry in the aspect of um, like switching the 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 turn of the tide of the fight, or I don't know how the fuck that you would say that, but. I know I'm able to react to it and block it, so why not just parry it and get the damage? Because there might not be... I mean, there's, there isn't many opportunities for Ryu to get damage, so in these spots, this would be good. And I would definitely tell people to parry people's wake-ups when you think they're going to reversal. Get the V-meter. Because if you get the V-meter and the crush counter, like Abuki, I just go back to hers, I'm pretty sure you get one bar... Or damn near almost one bar off of this uh, a bait on a guess. Now, if my guess gets me one beam in there, that guess support fake. I mean, now in turn, I get crush countered, but they gotta be on point. They most likely could late tag. Which, if they throw me, I don't mind that. I don't give a fuck about that, but. What's the bar? So... It's definitely worth it. Against Ibuki. Um... I'm gonna do some other characters coming up. Those are the three I just laid out at the moment. Thank you for watching. You know, like, subscribe, it helps. Appreciate it. Take care.